I just picked up two more pieces of used gear off of Guitar Center and I have a Pearl Roadster throne. This is the old black label. These feet here are very large. I would say that these are the old style feet that they used on the black label hardware. The black label hardware was the heavy duty hardware. These came out around the early 2000s. I have a lot of pieces of this black label hardware. I always liked pearl drums. I don't know if you can see that, but the, it says pearl right there. Barely make it out. <clears throat> and this is an old gold label straight stand. This is heavy. This straight stand right here is heavy. It's a tri stand. It's got three tubes. And um, this is another piece of heavy duty hardware here. Now the gold label goes back even further. This is like the 90s. Black label goes back to the early 2000s. So this is quite a throne, let me tell you what. Got the, the large pearl wing nuts and it's, it's older, it's older. I got this for under a hundred. The nails are starting to rust and some of them are starting to pop out. No big deal. This is pearl. This material that they put inside of this throne top is amazing. It's, it's nothing like any of my other thrones. I have three thrones already, and I sat on this top, and I, I gotta say, this is the most comfortable feeling top I've ever sat on. I don't know what's inside here, but they really put some amazing material inside of this. And this is a this is a cloth top. This is not a vinyl top. So it sits much different. If you sit on vinyl tops, you feel a lot different. The cloth top really it kind of keeps you s stuck to it in a way. Um, I mean, I'm not saying that you're going to slide off of a vinyl top, but the cloth top seems like it sticks to your pants you know like it really like you're not gonna move i would say it might actually be a little bit cooler i think it stays cooler than the vinyl tops comes apart like this and um then you can just pick this up all the way out there's ridges inside of there that lock the spindle as you can see you can see those ridges set it right here so I'll pick this up you just twist that drop it down and then lock it in and it's not gonna go anywhere yeah the Pearl Roadster Thrones these sell for you know over 200 new they're different now. They're much different now, but I would say if you're looking for a heavy-duty throne and you're looking to spend some money, Pearl Roadster thrones are pretty good. I mean, this these legs come out wide. Now, I can't really tell you much about this straight cymbal stand here, but it's got the old-school patent on it here. All the new symbol stands coming like this now. They used to put the nut on the side. You should tighten it here. Now they're all here. On this one, this actually unscrews. You can put a, a wrench to that. And you can actually unscrew that. Not sure why they made it that way. But like I said, these actually say pearl on them. I don't know. If you can see that but um, yeah I thought I would just pick this up because this is an old-school symbol stand and it is heavy this is professional this is a really heavy-duty stand here and they all had this type of a locking mechanism through the 90s 
all the way up until they changed it with the new hardware in 2004. They all had this type of a thing right here. In 2004, they redesigned this part, and it does not move. And, um, yeah, it's got some pretty good-sized feet, the old-school feet. They looked like this, squared. Now they look more like this, rounded. Or at least they did back in the 2000s. I'm not sure what they look like now. The hardware has changed. I'm kind of stuck in my old ways. And I like the hardware from uh, the 2000s. Because that's what I use and that's what I remember. And thanks to like eBay and uh, Guitar Center. There's quite a few of them out there still. I have never bought a new stand. All my hardware is used, but it's great. You know, it's all heavy-duty hardware. Now, this is not great to take out on gigs. I'm telling you, uh, you don't want to carry three of these in a bag with a hi-hat stand. No, no, you don't. No, sir. You definitely want to invest in a set of some lightweight hardware. That's it, guys. World Roadster Drum Thrones. I got an old one here, and guys, this thing is just a beast. So I can't imagine what the new ones are like. And uh, you're looking at a piece of history right here. This is probably early 90s. I just love drums, gear. I like talking about gear. Pearl Roadster Drum Thrones. Check them out. If you got one, put it in the comments. This top is small. It's only 13 inches. It is small. And um, it's actually a good thing. I don't have to take my nice Tama out, you know? <laughs> All right, gang. I'm out.